Hey, welcome back to the Mr. Excel Netcast. I'm Bill Jellen. Yesterday, we started to take a look at this data set that I eventually want to create a pivot table from, but currently, it's in the wrong format. Yesterday, we separated the model information from column B out to column A. Now, I need to fill in these blank cells. Basically, I want to take the word East and copy it down to all of the detail rows for East, and then Central and South and West, all the way through the data set. Well, there's a very easy way to do this. I'm going to select all of the blank cells, and I'm going to use Go To Special. Now, the fast way to get to that is to press the F5 key for Go To, and then click Special. If you're in Excel 2007, we can use Find and Select, Go To Special. If you're in Excel 2003, it's Edit, and then Go To, and Go To Special. Either way, we're going to choose Blanks, and then click OK, and that selects from within the original selection, just the blank cells. Now, we're three keystrokes away, the Equal sign, the Up Arrow, and then Control Enter will fill in all of those cells. Now, of course, at this point, I want to convert those formulas to values, but I have a non-contiguous range selected, so I can't copy and paste values here. I need to reselect the data. So, move up one cell, Control Shift Down Arrow, Control C to copy, and then paste, paste values in order to convert those to values. Well, now tomorrow, we'll take a look at a few more steps to get rid of the blank columns and blank rows, and then on Friday, take a look at how to solve these quarters going across. An amazing trick. Well, thanks for stopping by. We'll see you next time for another netcast from Mr. Excel.